I'm just like, hey, let me throw these three ingredients together and see what happened. And it is really nice. Super cheap, all natural ingredients that have made my hair feel like this. Okay now. What's up you guys, it's Shigeli Mani here. I'm back for another video. So today's video, I did a DIY pre-poo with some ingredients that I have never tried before and I just kind of thought about them even though I'm sure plenty of people have done it. I just didn't like research how the ingredients would blend together. I figured I would just give it a try. And that is what you see on my head right now. So what I did in this clip that I'm about to show you guys is pretty much juice one full avocado, an egg, and a whole aloe vera plant. I've been very interested in these three ingredients on my hair for a while, especially for a pre-poo. I needed something with a little bit of protein, which is why I used the egg. But with low porosity hair, I wanted to combat that with the moisture that the aloe vera gives. And I learned a little while ago that avocado is super good for your hair because of all like the natural oils the fatty acids, as well as the biotin properties that it's supposed to have. So I was like, you know what? We're gonna combine all three of these ingredients together and make it into a pre-poo. So first, pretty much what I did was I did the aloe vera plant first. I cut it up, it wasn't like a very big plant, so I decided to use the entire thing. I cut all the little meaty parts out of it and put it into my blender. I blended it all up and then squeezed all of the juices out just so I didn't have like the little pieces left which in my past experience have led to a lot of chunks in my hair that was hard to wash out later, so yeah. And then I cut up the avocado and put the egg in with the aloe vera, blended all of that up, and I got a super creamy, textured pre-poo that was very creamy, very thick, but not like super thick to the point where it was like hard to put on. And then like I do for all of my pre-poos, I use my spray bottle. I wet my hair first on either side, and then I just went into each side. I only split it into like two parts, I believe, and just ran it through my strands. It didn't penetrate my strands as amazing as I would have liked it to, but with low porosity hair, I kind of know better and I know I should be using steam if I want certain things to penetrate my hair, especially something as like raw as just like three food ingredients. So, I mean, it is what it is. But it did like very much loosen the tangles and knots and stuff from my hair pretty easily. So. I was happy. And then I went ahead and put this baggie on my head and I've been sitting with this on my head for about four hours now just because after I did that, what you just saw in the scene, I had a lot of work to do like my, my actual job remotely, whatever. So I've been doing that for like the last four hours and now I'm finally back and can wash this out. So before I wash it out, I just wanted to show you guys what we're working with and I'm actually taking it off for the first time myself. So, this is what we are working with. And my hair feels so soft, oh my goodness. Wow, oh my God. I got one tangle like right here that is really weird. There we go. Oh my goodness, you guys. My hair is like really, really soft right now. It feels amazing. I love this. All right now, okay. I'm sure this has been done plenty of times, but I feel like I invented it because I was just like, no, no, let me throw these three ingredients together and see what happened. And it is really nice this is super like my hair feels super soft it feels very hydrated it feels just like really really moisturized it's not too heavy like this feels great and of course you know anything that don't cost too much money okay like all these ingredients are super cheap i think i got the aloe vera plant where did i get that from I might have got that one from the supermarket actually and it was like less than a dollar. An egg comes in a dozen depending on where you get it from. I tend to shop at like ShopRite and stuff where I can get a like 18 eggs for like a dollar 19. So divide that and get that. And then the avocado, I don't remember how much I got that for. But again, it was when I was grocery shopping and I was actually gonna eat the avocado. I think I got it like two for three dollars or something like that. They were big, I don't know. I can't remember, but either way, Super cheap, all natural ingredients that have made my hair feel like 
this. Okay now. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and rinse this out and then shampoo my hair. And then I will let you guys know how my shampoo process went as soon as I'm done. All right guys, so I am all done shampooing and shampooing my hair was a breeze. Like my hair was so easy to just get through, get to the roots. And I didn't experience a lot of like tangles or snagging or anything like that. This is it. It's looking a little dry because I had my cotton t-shirt over my hair for a little while. So I'm about to spritz it up before I put my deep conditioner on. But yeah, this is what we're looking like right now. And my hair after washing it, I use the same shampoo for the most part for the last like four shampoo days in a row. And my hair is feeling very lovely and very soft and just ready to tackle the rest of my wash day. So I'm happy and I'm glad because this is a super easy DIY, super cheap DIY. And just the fact that I know every ingredient, three, that's going into my hair just makes me really happy. And I definitely want to, I think I told you guys in another video, but I definitely want to start moving more towards the DIY stuff. So stay tuned while I experiment with some more ingredients. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you hit that subscribe button if you're not subscribed already with the notification bell so you can be notified every time I do another video, especially a DIY. Comment below some DIYs that you think I should try for my low porosity hair that you think would be nice, whether it's pre-poo, a deep conditioner, leave-in, whatever it is. I would love to try it. Smash that like button if you guys are feeling me do the DIY video. And other than that, I will see you guys for my next one. Bye!